A Republican-led investigation into popular Democratic fundraising platform Act Blue for alleged illegal fundraising practices is now expanding to 19 other states. The platform is accused of using fraudulent methods, potentially violating campaign finance laws. This probe has drawn attention nationwide, with GOP lawmakers claiming possible money laundering. The investigation centers on accusations that Act Blue, which has raised more than $15 billion in the last 20 years, was used to skirt campaign finance laws and potentially launder donations to avoid contribution limits. The concerns stem from the practice known as smurfing, where large donations are broken down into smaller contributions under different names to conceal their true origin. According to a coalition of Republican state attorneys general, Act Blue may have processed donations from individuals who were unaware their names were being used. The probe began in Texas late last year and has since expanded across the country, involving 19 other states. In a letter sent to the CEO of Act Blue, attorneys general in these states raised concerns over a pattern of suspicious donations, particularly from individuals with low net worths who were unlikely to have made large contributions as seen in Act Blue's filings with the Federal Election Commission. As part of the investigation, Act Blue has been asked to provide details on its security protocols. The platform has since implemented additional measures, such as requiring CVV codes for all credit card donations to prevent fraudulent activity. In a statement, Act Blue says it has a long-standing record of compliance with campaign finance laws, and it calls the allegations a politically motivated attempt to spread misinformation before the election. The company has been asked to respond to the AG's inquiry by October 23rd. For more unbiased updates and straight facts, Download the Straight Arrow News app or visit san.com. For Straight Arrow News, I'm Lauren Taylor.